So as of recently, COD players have been orgasming over the resurfaced leak of custom games or private matches for Warzone, but this time the leaks are real and showcase actual gameplay of them. Now not to gloat, but being max rank in Season 6, completing the battle pass without paying for tiers, and having 66 wins despite skill-based matchmaking, I could really go for some private matches right now. These matches are not official as of yet, but have been glitched into by Detective Waffle and Glitch Hunter. Over the past few days, I've been researching on Twitter and the internet about further official world from Infinity World themselves on this matter, but all I've seen is that the private matches are still being hosted nearly daily, and that YouTube videos such as the one you'll see in this video are out there. Now, you might speculate that these matches are for the devs to record the trailers in without having to go to private matches, and that's what I believed at first, until I saw this image here, which places emphasis on joining with friends and not co-workers, like it would say at the Infinity World offices. I don't speak on behalf of Infinity War when it comes to these private matches being released, but I could place a bet that these matches are coming to Warzone rather soon. There's an update for 1.28 coming out on Wednesday, and as of the time this video is uploaded, no patch notes have concretely been released, but I would not bet that this update would have the custom games, although it is possible. We have proof that these are authentic custom games, as you can see here, there are being less than 150 players jumping out of the AC-130 at the beginning, whereas in normal war zone, the lobby would require about 140 to start. We can also see squad selection in the screen as well, which also allows you to switch teams based on your chemistry with others and whatnot. There's also confirmation that we have access to settings such as circle speed, revive time, bleed out time, downed health, health, and even numbers of lives. We will be able to choose between plunder and normal battle royale, of which will contain your normal roads ranging from solos, duos, trios, and quads, you know, and also juggernaut royale and, I believe, armored royale. This is quite a lot to swallow, uh, it makes me really wonder if we can possibly have a circle close immediately if players are outside of it, as well as have the option to choose whereabouts the circle will end. My only question is why was this not released earlier? Blackout had it at launch, but looking at Warzone, keep in mind we only had trios and plunder at the start of it, we received solos and quads within a week of launch, but duos came a month and a half after. Regardless, I'm sure many of you who take interest in Warzone are likely to be excited by the custom games, such as Michael Myers and Hunted. Definitely will be a blast, I'll say that much, but until we hear from official word from Infinity World, we'll just have to wait in suspense. Now before I sign off, I just thought it'd be interesting to show you some random rage taging from five-year-olds using the dick sticks. Enjoy. <laughs> Oh my god. 